The payoff is a base hit off the glove of Wynn, trickles into left field. Soto will score. On to third goes Torres. It's an RBI single for Verdugo. And the Yankees take an early 1-0 lead. Well, you look where this pitch is. It's a sinker away. Verdugo just goes the other way. And because of the carom, watch Bobby Witt Jr. It goes off his glove, almost hits Soto. Not trying to do too much. LeMayu lays down a bunt beautifully. Torres will score, and the Yankees take a 2-0 lead on the safety squeeze from D.J. LeMayhew. Well, set up perfectly. You look where the third baseman Garcia is set up. The first baseman, Perez, he's way behind for the first base bag. He's holding on the runner, but he'll go back, and this is just a perfect bunt and a great jump by Torres over at third. He bounced back from that moment to the way he's performed this year. And just talked about the way he's focused on his work day in, day out as the slide and catch is made by Jones for out number one. One in the sun. He gets a late jump because it's tough. He's setting up in the sun, and that ball's not hit real well and is really hard to judge. There you see he goes from sun to shade. A one, two. Went down and in. Cabrera to second for one, on to first. It's a double play. Well executed on the pitch selection from Jeff Nelson. We go to the third, 2 nothing Yanks. On a righty, if you're a left-handed pitcher, you need something to sink away. On the 12th pitch, 98 down the middle. And Carlos Rodon fired up after winning that battle with Renfro. Well, a lot of all-speed pitches to Renfro, a few off his front foot. Swing and a miss again. Just said, here's the heater. And Blanco eaten up by it. Two straight strikeouts on fastballs from Rodon. Well, nice job, too, because you knew the slider was probably going to speed up his bat. So you just stay with heat. Second and third, two out. Line drive, base hit center field. LeMahieu scores. Here comes Grisham. He will score. It's a two out, two run single from Jose Trevino, and the Yankee lead is 4-0. Well, he gets a sinker upstairs. Not a lot of sink with that. That's the second hit for Trevino. That's a big one. Scores two. Abrams is on that team. You had Arizona's Corbin Carroll, Riley Green for the Tigers. Oh, nice diving stop. LeMayu flips to Rodon for the out. What a gem. LeMayu to Rodon for the second out of the fourth. He falls off to the third base side, and to be over, be able to get over there and beat Witt Jr. to the bag, that's outstanding play all around. You see how he falls off to the third base side just to get over there and be able to get to the base before the speedy Witt Jr. The 0-2. Grounded to short, could be another double play. To second for one, on to first. It is a 6-4-3 double play, two down now in the fifth. The last at-bat against Fermin, it was a slider down. This time he goes upstairs with a fastball. It was supposed to be away, but it was out over, but it was up. The 0-2. He got him. Looking at 96. That Barry about where this pitch was. And you see where Trevino was setting up way outside, and he had to reach back, but it was right over the middle of the plate. Yeah. And there you see where Barry, the home plate umpire, setting. The 0 2. Base hit center field. Perez being waved home. Here's the throw from Grisham. It's cut off. The Royals are on the board. It's a 4 1 game. Chopped. There, down the left field line. Blanco will score. Witt is at second with an RBI double. And it's a 4-2 game. Trying to make it stick. The 0-2. He got him. The throw down to first to finish it up. And Michael Tonkin with his second career save as the Yankees win this opener. 4-2 the final. Thank you.